Hello, everyone. The following drawing is based on a true story. Viewer discretion is advised. I'm just kidding. Anyone can watch this. <clears throat> I just always wanted to say that. So today we're going to draw a running dog based on my dog, Sophie, and her little trip into the pool. So Sophie, when we first got her, oh, she's here too. Now you might be able to hear her crying. She's being a bit of a pain right now. She's got a sock in her mouth. She loves her socks. This line right here that I'm drawing is going to be part of her chest. So this is her leg. I got this. And then the back really curves up quite a bit. Comes around and comes up like so. Watching dogs run is just an amazing thing. They are so fast. Even little dogs are just so fast. You might be able to hear, so here's the chest. And there's that back leg. And there'll be a bit of a cast shadow. And yeah, we can put some little little bit of shading. There'll be some around this collar. And Sophie has spots on her. So let's draw some spots. If you want to make your dog, draw your dog instead of Sophie, you can. Sophie has kind of those raccoon eyes. Oh, we got some dog drool. And the cast shadow. It's going to be separate from the, the dog because she is running. And Sophie is chasing a ball. Right into a swimming pool. So this is water, and I just, I don't want a straight line. I want to kind of give it a sense that maybe it might be moving. And this is separate. It's kind of a, it's Sophie, she's right here trying to bother me. And Sophie doesn't have a doghouse, but let's just draw one and get a little bit more practice with linear perspective. So here's uh, no cats. There we go. So I'm going to put my vanishing point right here. So uh, let's take care of this. So you could use a ruler. Going to the vanishing point. The peak of the roof is going to go to the vanishing point. And like that. <laughs> so starting from this corner, this line, this line right here is going to go to your vanishing point. And where they meet, there's your corner of the doghouse. And we'll 
shade this in a little bit. It'll be darker inside the doghouse. And the back wall, I'm making it a, just a value darker so you can distinguish between the two. And let's put this light over so this side. shadow and let's have a horizon line and we'll put in some hills since our light is coming from here we know the sides of these hills are going to be shadowed around with this where you can make it light and dark really does give it a little bit of texture I'm gonna make this side a little darker just to distinguish And I do think we're going to see a little bit of this doghouse reflecting in the pool. And there we have it. That's our drawing for today. Thanks.